My name is Sarah Fletcher, the Executive Director of Westwood Community Access Television, and I'm here with Lindsay Andella from the Lowell Humane Society, and we're zooming in on an adoptable pet of the week. Hi, Lindsay. Hi, Sarah. Thank you for having us. I'm glad you're here. Who do you have today? Yeah, so today I'm here with Tigger, who is a six-year-old um, adoptable cat. He um, is a sweet boy, but he takes a little bit of time to come around. Um, so he's looking, still looking for his forever home. Um, he's definitely very playful, uh, likes to climb up on the cat towers, play with all of his toys, um, and he would make a really great companion for the right family. Okay, and how did he happen to come to the shelter? Yeah, so Tigger ended up um, coming to the shelter because his home that he was in was just not the right match for him. He really would like to go to a home that has no other pets um, and no young children. So an adult-only home where he can be kind of the center of attention would be a really great match for him. How long has he been at the shelter, Lindsay? Um, so he came in uh, back in um, April, I believe, and he did receive some medical treatment. Um, so he's been here for quite a bit of time, um, but he had a hernia repair and a couple of dental extractions. Um, so now he's nice and healthy and doing really well. Um, and yeah, he would definitely make a really wonderful pet for somebody that is uh, looking to have a companion that they can spend plenty of time with. Uh, he can be a little bit shy at first. It takes a little bit of time for him to come around. Um, but with plenty of temptations, treats, he will be your best friend. <laughs> um, and he's a really good cat once he gets to know you, for sure. <laughs> Who knew that cats had hernia problems? <clears throat> I had no idea. Um, is there any follow-up that needs to be done because of that surgery? Uh, so we always recommend that you take your pets to the vet annually for checkups, but for that surgery, it's all taken care of at this point in time, and he's ready to go off to his uh, his forever home, and, um, you know, there's no follow-up care directly related to that at this time, so he he's ready to go. <laughs> okay, and so if somebody's interested in adopting Tigger, do they come to the shelter directly? Do they have to make an appointment? What's the What's the scoop there? Yeah, that's a great question. So we do have um, open hours now every day besides Monday from noon to 4 p.m. So you're more than welcome to come down and meet Tigger. Uh, we definitely recommend, though, if you're able to, to make an adoption appointment and reach out to us either by email or phone to speak with a staff member to see if he'd be a good fit. Um, and then we can put you on the calendar to come down and meet him. Okay. And, and Lindsay, what's the address for the shelter? The address for the shelter is 951 Broadway Street in Lowell, um, and then you can reach us at info at LowellHumaneSociety.org if you'd like to um, inquire about him or speak with a staff member. Terrific. Well, thank you very much for introducing us to Tigger today, and we will see you next week. Thank you so much. I'm Sarah for Westford Cat. Thanks for tuning in.